Hello guys, how you doing? This is your friend Alex. On June 16, 2018, I created this video. The title of the video is called Move from Android to iOS, right? And unfortunately, I was not able to accomplish this task. So on this video, I want to show you a possible solution for the error could not communicate with this device. Actually, on my video, I already pinned the possible solution by Jason Chang. And I'm gonna try to mimic this and show you how to do it, guys. So I have two phones, an iPhone that is ready to be set up, and I have this Android. And on this opportunity, I have the Redmi 7, and it has Android 9, Android Pie. The first thing you need to do, guys, of course, you know, you need to download an app called Move to iOS. So we already have it here. I'm gonna select English, United States, quick start, and we're gonna click uh, Set Manually. Data privacy, continue, set up later. So we're just gonna skip some stuff, guys, to make it faster, all right? You can add this later, all right? Don't use passcode. All right, so this is the screen that we need, guys, apps and data. And from here, you're gonna click on move data from Android. Here, you're gonna see that it's already asking you to pop up the, the app on the Android device, all right? So we're gonna click continue. First, I want to show you the error, right? We're gonna agree on this, find your code. So we have the code already, and we're gonna click next. So you have to go all the way here, all right? And we're gonna input the code, 212-634, all right? And it's gonna try to connect to the iPhone. Chances are it's not gonna work, because I tried before. But then I'm gonna explain you how to fix this. You see, the Wi-Fi network has no access to the internet, that's one message, and then what else? Now we have another one, another message the same. So I think you get my point. It's trying to connect, but it does not connect. So you look at this, could not communicate with the device, and it's asking me for another code. What I want to show you guys is, every time the iPhone creates a code for you, what it's gonna do is, it's gonna create a, a Wi-Fi network, okay? So if you see here and you go to your Wi-Fi, you will see you will see a network created by the iPhone. And this is here it is guys, look at this. iOS 92 CFC. This is gonna change. But what you need to do, guys, is basically you need to go here and you're gonna the password is exactly this. So lowercase i, uppercase O, uppercase S, and then you have you have to put a space and whatever number you have so 92 cfc and you're going to connect so supposedly now you're connected to the wi-fi that the iphone created and now you can go back to the app and see if it's going to work all right 429833 and see if this time is going to work i hope it will look move to android so it looks like it's working guys say preparing and yeah it's working guys so we solved the problem because now it's asking me what do i want to transfer and uh it's waiting for the redmi so i'm just gonna yeah i just they already selected i'm just gonna click next and now it's doing the transfer and now it's doing the transfer guys so i just wanted to make it right guys because i know in the video i couldn't show you a solution my intention to upload the video was for somebody to put the answer on the comments this is happening on apple forums everywhere so a lot of people got mad and you know i have 665 thumbs down and only 155 thumbs up on my video you can see it here but because of my video we were able to find the solution and I want to thank uh, Jason again. Jason Chang is the one that solved this problem. His solution is the one that is working. And later on, guys, maybe on another video, I'm gonna show you more details about how this Move From Android app works. But in this video, I think I accomplished the task. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, guys, for more videos like this. And I see you in the next one. Peace, take care, bye.